comparing Chengdu J20 with F22, F35 and Supak Far or T50. We have witnessed a lot about the Chinese stealth fighter J-20, being developed by the Chinese aircraft manufacturer Chengdu. The J-20 is a fifth-generation aircraft with stealth capabilities. Only time will tell if the J-20 will match the current stealth aircrafts or will be superior than them. The F-22 Raptor has proven technology and hence it has been speculated that most of the fifth generation aircrafts today are similar to the Raptor. It is also speculated that this proven design of the F-22 has either been taken by spying, purchasing and then reverse engineered to create a new prototype by rival nations. That is the main reason why US is not exporting the F-22, because they fear that nations like China and Russia would use their designs especially after 1.7 terabytes of top secret information was stolen from them. If we compare the look and design of J-20 you will find that it has a delta wing canard layout, whereas the F-22 and F-35 have both diamond wing conventional layout. The frontal aspect of J-20 looks extremely similar to that of American F-35 JSF with twin DSI and taken V-shaped tail. The J-20 has a canard delta twin engine configuration, diverted less supersonic intakes, and a shaped nose consistent with the use of an active electronically scanned array, a RESA, radar. To maintain stealth, the F-22 carries its weapons in internal bays. The J-20 seems to be fitted with WS-10 engines, rather than WS-15 but this cannot be confirmed. The thrust generated by J-20 is 180k and which leads to better engine performance. The F-22 Raptor has dual afterburning Pratt and Whitney F-119 PW100 turbofans incorporate pitch axis thrust vectoring, with a range of 20 degrees. The maximum thrust is classified, though most sources place it at about 156 km. The F-35's main engine is the Pratt & Whitney F-135. The General Electric slash Rolls-Royce F-136 is being developed as an alternative engine. The pac far was expected to use a pair of Saturn 117S engines on its first flights producing 140 km thrust in the afterburner. The pac far would be the first fifth generation fighter with full 3D thrust vectoring along all three aircraft axes, pitch, yaw and roll. The J-20 design is similar to the Lockheed Martin F-22 Raptor and the Sukhoi T-50 fighters. Sources indicate the twin-engine J-20 prototype could be using the Russian-built Saturn 117S. AL-41F1A engine, the same being used in the T-50 and Su-35 prototypes. China has expressed interest in procuring large quantities of the Saturn 117S from Russia and rumors of the recent Zuhe air show in China indicate a J-20 prototype had been outfitted with the 117S. The F-22 Raptor uses an slash APG-77 ESA radar, designed for air superiority and strike operations, features a low observable, active aperture, electronically scanned array that can track multiple targets in any weather. The main sensor on board of the F-35 is its an slash APG-81 ESA radar designed by Northrop Grumman Electronic Systems, and is augmented by the Electro-Optical Targeting System, EOTS, mounted under the nose of the aircraft, designed by Lockheed Martin. <laughs> 
for the T50 Pack FA. Radar with APA error is provided by an i first P the J20 is stated to use an advanced radar however the make of it is still not known. Although J20 appears as a better stealth aircraft than the rest, the Chinese pilots are not as experienced than the US pilots. The US has pilots that have been in combat situations for years. Moreover the AWACs, missile technology, radar tech, ETC are all championed by the US and Russia. It's time to wait and watch how the J-20 performs in future as compared to the rest. It is interesting to note that on our previous article Chengdu J-20 China's first stealth fighter takes to the skies we got lot of traffic from US Canada, UK, Australia, South Korea and Japan. We wonder if this news came as a shock to these countries. Also we got lot of response from China too, considering the tight-lipped Chinese government this news must have been a pleasant surprise for the Chinese people. What do you think about the comparison of these fighters against J-20? Although it is too soon to tell, let us know what you think. Thank you for watching. Please check out my other videos. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.